Hello, Jonathan Silva here with a video for end users. This video covers how to edit items, move through the workflow, and add a work log. First, type shift question mark on your keyboard to see a list of all keyboard shortcuts. Use the E shortcut to edit the selected item. Any field that is bolded is required, and you need to enter a value before saving and closing. The E shortcut also works when you have multiple items selected, and you like to change one particular field. Multi-selected items can also be clicked and dragged to other team members or other customers. To view and edit all fields for an item, select the item and hit Edit in the main toolbar. This is one place where you can edit the workflow. You can also change the workflow step by selecting the item and clicking Workflow. Alternatively, you can use Card View to change or assign workflow steps. In Card View, simply click and drag items through the workflow. You may be restricted from moving an item to a blocked or unauthorized step, depending on your administrator settings. When logging time spent on your work, you have a few options. The easiest way is to use our keyboard shortcut W with the user story selected. Enter your work log by assigning the entry as billable or non-billable, along with any pertinent notes. This is also where you can update the remaining time estimate, which is the value used to calculate your burndown chart. Another way to add work logs is through the details panel. Select a user story, and then click add from the work log section of the panel. If you don't see work logs, click on this icon in the upper right corner of the details panel to enable it along with any other parameters you want to view or hide. Just like work logs, you can add or edit items through the details panel. To view all past work logs, go to this icon in the upper right of the main workspace and click on the work logs tab. By clicking on this tab, you can filter by item type, by billable or non-billable, or by when the work log was created. For example, if I click on Ariel, I can see all the work logs she's posted for this project. Those are the basic editing, workflow, and work log features. For additional help, take a look at our documentation, our support page, or other quick start videos. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.